Welcome to Adalo's Two Minute Tuesdays. This week, we're talking about empty states. This is a way to show your users information when there's no data. So let's talk about why empty states are so important. First of all, it kind of looks broken without empty states. Buttons and text are misaligned, but when you have it, it's nice. Next is that it helps your users. So a blank screen doesn't tell them what to do, but a nice button does. All right, so let's talk about empty states for lists. The first thing we're gonna do is design the actual empty state itself. A good design for an empty state starts with a main image, a big piece of text to tell them why there's no data, a little help text to actually give them encouragement to take an action, and then a button to actually take that action. So once we've got our empty state designed nice and pretty, I'm gonna select all the components and I'm gonna group them together. And then we're gonna change the visibility. We're gonna make it sometimes visible if, in this case, the events count is equal to zero. That way, if there's no events, then show up. But I'm gonna take this to the next step and actually so the start time is before the current time. That way it shows up only if there's future events. So now when we preview it and I go, I still don't see an event, but I can add an event once a user adds an actual event and puts that the start time in the future, then when they create it, it'll now show up in your upcoming events. Lastly, let's talk about empty states for single elements. So when you have an image and you hook that image up to data, for example, logged in user profile picture, you really need to set a placeholder image. Placeholder images keep the alignment as well as encourage users to actually fill out that information. Next, sometimes you have labels that go with a piece of data it's really important to group the label with the data itself and actually change the visibility so that both of them won't show up if there's no data. So in this case, if the logged in user location is not equal to empty, then I want it to be visible. I'm gonna do the same thing for my phone number as well. That way when I go and preview it, I see a nice placeholder and I don't see those labels because there's no information for that person. So I'm actually gonna give this person a profile picture. Now I see that. And then if they go and they edit, and they add a location as well as a phone number, then the labels and the fields itself show up. Empty states are a great way to take your user experience to the next level.